This study here was undertaken in Victoria in Australia and they looked at the incidence of out-of-hospital cardiac arrests over time. Now, Australia is a particularly good country to do this type of study because we have a very high vaccination rate and very few people got COVID prior to widespread vaccination. So let's have a look at what they found. The data they have collected is for what they define as young people who are people aged under 50. I personally think young is much older than that, but that's what they're calling it. In this figure, orange is sudden cardiac arrest of unknown cause. Yellow is sudden cardiac arrest caused by myocarditis. And blue is all cardiac arrests. The figure also shows COVID cases in green and COVID vaccinations in a pinky red colour. And it's important to note that the COVID cases and vaccinations are at different scales to cardiac arrests and to each other. So although it looks like they are similar towards the end of the figure, they actually aren't and vaccinations are over 10 times higher than COVID cases. The figure covers three time periods. The first period is before COVID. The second period is after COVID arrived in Australia, although, as I previously mentioned, rates were still very low compared with other countries in the world. And the final time period is after COVID vaccination was introduced in Australia. The first thing to notice in this figure is that contrary to the claims of anti-vaxxers, young people have sadly always had sudden cardiac arrest. So unfortunately, there is nothing unusual in young people dying suddenly. The second thing to notice is that since the COVID vaccines were introduced in Australia, there has been no increase in overall cardiac arrests, no increase in sudden cardiac arrests from unknown causes and no increase in cardiac arrests caused by myocarditis. In addition to looking at population level data, they also looked at sudden deaths that occurred within 30 days of vaccination and compared these with the baseline rate. And they found that there was no significant deviation from the baseline profile of causes of young sudden death. So while anti-vax schools add to the grief of families by sharing stories of their loved ones' sudden passings with false innuendos about the causes, the science clearly shows that vaccines are not increasing the rates of cardiac arrest. 